Hi, hello, Oliver here. Um, today I want to respond uh, again to uh, one of the questions that I got. It's about the purchasing and the buying of high-end microscopes. And uh, the text or the question is as follows. These videos are highly useful, Oliver. Thank you. Thank you very much for back to you. This might sound like uh, to be a silly question, but uh, better to ask early to, and to avoid regret. Well, then it cannot be a silly question. And if you buy a high-end microscope such um, as a, an Olympus, are they, um, are they generally sold complete with objectives and eyepieces uh, from sellers? Or are you paying hundreds or even thousands of dollars uh, for the body and then have to spend hundreds or more um, ob on objectives, eyepieces and so on, etc. Uh, thank you for the question. Um, I would say both is possible and um, in order to explain this um, on how I bought this high-end microscope, my Olympus CH40, so it was over 20 years ago already, I think I'm going to just uh, tell you the complete story because uh, I think it might still apply nowadays. Um, okay, so first of all, if you want to buy yourself a um, low-end or medium-range microscope, often it's like this that these companies um, um, are um, sell their products over Amazon, and then you simply uh, select a product, you read the Amazon reviews, and you choose a product and you buy it, and uh, then you get a yeah um, by post you get a, a box uh, with a microscope. Okay, so normal stuff, right? Um, when I bought uh, the uh, Olympus microscope uh, um, 21 years ago, or back in 1998, uh, as a matter of fact, it was like this that um, I actually first uh, phoned up uh, the, the, the office, the Olympus office um, in the town where I lived, um, and uh, I made an appointment uh, with uh, one of the people there, uh, one of the experts there. So, um, and I showed up uh, there, um, and uh, for a full hour, uh, we discussed uh, the microscopes. And actually, I, I was very um, open and honest um, about my needs. Uh, about the microscope and I told him look I'm an amateur um, I have no specific research needs I want to have a general purpose microscope and then sure enough um, he basically presented me a microscope uh, which was the so-called the Olympus CH2 which is uh, very similar to the this one over here it's not this one is CHA model it's a little bit older but uh, the Olympus CH2 that was kind of a, the follow-up model. That's basically what he suggested for amateur use. Uh, he basically, it was an economical price that he made um, and I was not happy with that and I said, look, I want to have more, okay? Um, and then ultimately I told him I want to have the CH40 and I told him exactly which eyepieces I wanted to have, which objectives I wanted to have and all of these things. Um, and then uh, sure enough, um, um, I had to wait a week uh, and then I could pick up the microscope. I paid in cash, I remember, um, and uh, then basically I got the bill and the bill was the following. It listed all of the parts uh, that the microscope is made of because what they have done is, is they put together the microscope based on my needs. So they did not uh, sell a complete pack right uh, from the beginning, but actually I told them um, and we discussed the whole thing um, and I told him what I wanted. And uh, then he basically wrote this down and he um, assembled the microscope for me. Okay. Um, so the answer is, is kind of a little bit, yeah, you basically end up paying separately um, for the things because what they will do is, is uh, these are research or not uh, not high-end research microscopes here but they, they sold this as a doctor's microscope different people have different uh, wishes desires needs and what they will do is, is because of the modularity of those microscopes they will basically put it together uh, the way that you want you as a customer want uh, the microscope to be put together and simply to show you um, how the bill looked like I'm basically I've got the original bill from 1998 here um, it's written in German, um, uh, but I'm simply going to show you what, what it, uh, yeah, the different parts, and uh, it should kind of make it clear to you that essentially, ultimately, um, yeah, you pay what you want to have, and it, they basically listed the different uh, parts. So I'm just going to show this to you now. So I'm going to show you now the bill of the microscope. It's written in German, so I'm going to be translating this. The currency, these are the old, uh, it's the old Austrian currency shillings. Meanwhile, we have euros. But the, my point is really the following. This here, that is the, the body of the microscope, okay? Uh, it's listed here separately. That is the power supply cable. This here are uh, two light bulbs, so you see they charge them extra. That is uh, the trinocular photo uh, tube. Um, this uh, basically are two eyepieces. That is um, the condenser. It goes on on the next page even. That is a Köhler help lens. Um, that is uh, the cable. Um, yeah, that's a piece of plastic where you can wrap your cable around. That's simply the cable holder. Um, these are the objectives, uh, and that's basically the final sum. Okay, that's uh, based. That's 20% uh, value added tax. And then I also asked him, please give me an offer for um, 
the um, photo adapter tube and that is basically the um, the adapter that is uh, the eyepiece the photo projection eyepiece another adapter and then uh, at that time I had Minolta camera so there was also a, a Minolta camera adapter ring so you see that even here everything is listed okay um, so while you end up of course paying ultimately one uh, one sum at the end um, what they will do is, is they will put together the microscope based um, on your needs um, sometime later I decided uh, to um, to actually um, buy this dark field um, condenser batch stop so I called them up and sure enough uh, they also charge uh, this extra okay and here um, I bought, I bought uh, an extra 20 times uh, 20x eyepiece um, which they sent me and uh, of course I also had to pay extra okay so you see that uh, in the case of the high-end Olympus microscope uh, they basically put together the microscope based um, on your requirements and your needs and I recently asked them for a new offer and I asked them about the cheapest introductory microscope that they have and it's the CX23 with uh, three um, objectives and the total cost is around 900 euros but uh, this is excluding 20% uh, tax so, so that is uh, the basically an example of where they um, present you not uh, the individual uh, parts but actually one final sum but I can imagine that uh, when you actually um, buy the microscope that they're also going to give you a complete list of all the parts um, and what they would cost individually yeah okay so in summary um, how does this work um, essentially the answer is both yes and no um, you end up paying separately for the things uh, or um, if uh, you, uh, they can give you a complete package uh, but then ultimately also end up paying separately because they will put it together for you. Um, what is the advantage of this or, or in other words you might wonder why is there such a huge price difference? I mean there is a huge pr price difference and one of the reasons is, is that the target group of those high-end microscopes is different. They, they're targeting research companies, uh, organizations, uh, um, research organizations, the police departments, they work uh, with high-end microscopes. And what they want is, is they want to have reliable devices. And if there's a problem, I don't know, a light bulb breaks or something, um, you simply call up uh, the company um, or a certified uh, service uh, companies and they will come and they will fix uh, the microscope for you. Okay, um, So they have a, a certain network uh, installed and if you want to have spare parts if you say for whatever reason I'm not happy with your, your, those eyepieces I want to have new ones I want to have a new objective you simply uh, contact the company and they will send it to you if you buy uh, complete microscopes from uh, uh, let's say medium to low end uh, uh, yeah, retailers and often it, uh, basically this uh, is something that uh, we've been doing now in, in, in school we wanted to um, buy me, uh, medium to low range microscopes uh, because we needed to, to uh, have microscopes for full classroom it was like this that uh, you also talk to a person um, and they will send it to you and I asked the person well actually we don't need the, the full microscope can you please supply the microscope without objectives because we have so many functioning uh, spare objectives from the old microscopes so we want to save a little bit of money and, and we just want to reuse the objectives and the optics because I mean the eyepieces they don't break uh, so so easily if you take care of them and we had several of them so we said let's save a little bit of money and maybe you can just send send us the body and uh, then the, he said I'm sorry uh, the, the, uh, they, they won't uh, deliver it like this okay you only can buy the microscope the manufacturer puts everything together in one complete uh, set and that's the way it's sold there is no possibility actually to to um, yeah buy separate parts that easily it might also not be worth it because the overall cost is not so high so we then decide okay then just let's just forget about it we just buy a new microscope then okay but so you see that there's a little bit of a different approach on, on how uh, microscopes are being sold how parts are being sold and and, and so on and for those very high-end microscopes, um, um, it make, kind of makes sense to, to have, um, yeah, the, for the company to have interchangeable parts. They, they, they stock all of those things and then if you need something, you simply contact them, uh, you ring them up and you tell them what you want to have and uh, they will give you an appropriate uh, uh, support and then they will send it to you. Okay, So that is uh, one of the advantages for those high-end microscopes. But this might not be something that uh, amateurs or that you might use uh, in education and so on because uh, the, it's, uh, the needs are entirely different you know so um, it's uh, the point that I kind of want to make is, is maybe you don't pay for the microscope alone but maybe for the whole um, support system that you have um, in the background okay there is however one last thing that I also want to say because um, I wanted to buy a new objective for my 
CH40 microscope as well. And I called up the company and uh, they told me, sorry, we don't have uh, those objectives anymore because we changed uh, oh, the system, the microscopy system already a long time ago. You have to understand that nowadays, uh, the, all of those high-end companies, they moved towards so-called infinity systems. And, and those infinity optical systems are not compatible with uh, the traditional 160 millimeter system that uh, those microscopes have. So this is a little bit of a, an unfortunate thing. So, um, but uh, because those high-end microscopes were so popular um, many years ago, it's like this, that uh, there is still a second-hand market. And this actually allowed me to buy over eBay um, different parts uh, for the different microscopes. So for example, this one, the CHA microscope, I bought myself new phase contrast objectives and I also bought myself a phase uh, contrast uh, condenser here. So you can see that uh, you have to kind of resort to the second-hand market a little bit, um, but that also works. So I think that is, uh, that's all I want to say now um, concerning, the, if you have any qu further questions, of course, please post them. Um, a channel like this uh, also kind of lives from the support of its viewers. And for this reason, um, if you're interested in this channel, please uh, like and subscribe. Um, this actually helps the channel a little bit. And please also check out the other links that I have in the, in, in the, in the comment section. I now also put together a um, over Amazon, a microscopy shop. Uh, I'm personally not selling these things, but uh, essentially simply made, um, put affiliate links uh, to, to other products. Uh, so maybe you find something there that also interests you. Wish you a nice day. All the best. Happy, micro, happy micro hunting. Bye-bye.